Imagine waking up every morning with a sense of purpose that radiates from deep within you, guiding every decision you make and every step you take. Picture a life where you feel completely aligned with who you truly are, where literally inner peace and fulfillment are your constant companions. This can be you starting today. Hello everyone, Gabby here. Don't forget to subscribe and like also write down any stories you had. I always love reading the comment section. Also make sure to watch till the end because this is a reality within your grasp. By calibrating your soul to who you really are, you unlock the door to a life of abundance and authenticity. Calibrating your soul to who you truly are is more than just a concept. It's the practical path to living your best life. It's about aligning your thoughts, actions, and values with your innermost being, allowing you to live in harmony with yourself and the world around you. When you're in tune with your true self, you experience greater joy, fulfillment, and success in all areas of your life. But what does it mean to calibrate your soul? Think of it like tuning a musical instrument. Just as each instrument has its own unique sound, each person has their own unique essence, their soul. When your soul is out of tune, you may feel disconnected, restless, or unfulfilled. Calibrating your soul involves realigning yourself with your true nature, tapping into your inner wisdom and authenticity. I personally have a lot going on in my life, and this practice has helped me numerous times. You see, for me, soul calibration is as important as a hair routine or a skin routine. I have to do this and it helps me so much. Let's say after a very long week of stressful hours, dealing with customers yelling at me and life being life whenever I have a day off. I will schedule it just for that. One day a week, I claim it as my relaxation day, my calibration day. What makes me happy right now is working on my YouTube channel. So each time I work on a new video, I will light up a candle. I actually have different candles for different purposes. Usually when I am doing a YouTube video, I focus on healing. Healing as in getting the bad energy out and focusing on my goals. It allows for some personal time with myself. I also meditate. When I do that, I have a few extra candles that I like to light up and just sit there for a period of time focusing on my breath, vibrations, and calibrations. By doing this, your soul brings a whole lot of goodness into your life. Like seriously profound stuff. First off, you get to be your authentic self. No more pretending or trying to fit into someone else's mold. It's like finally taking a deep breath and saying, Hey world, this is me, flaws and all. When you're in tune with your soul's desires, it's like finding a cozy little corner of calm within yourself, even when everything else around you is chaos. You just feel this deep sense of contentment that doesn't depend on what's happening outside. When you're living authentically, you're not just going through the motions. You're doing things that light you up from the inside out. Whether it's painting, hiking, or spending time with loved ones, you're doing stuff that brings you real genuine joy. And guess what? Success comes knocking too. When you're true to yourself, you tap into your full potential. It's like unlocking a superpower you didn't even know you had. And the crazy thing is, opportunities start showing up left and right, ones that actually line up with what you really want out of life. All right, so how do you do it? First up is self-reflection. Take a breather and really think about who you are deep down. Ask yourself some big questions. What do you care about? What gets you fired up? And hey, writing it all down in a journal can really help you figure things out. I have many journals as well for different purposes. Now listen to that little voice inside your head, your intuition. Trust it even if it seems a bit quiet at first, it's got your back. Now let's talk about values. What do you stand for? What makes you tick? Figuring out your core values is like setting your life's compass. When you make decisions that line up with these values, you'll feel like you're living authentically. And speaking of authenticity, it's time to embrace your quirks. You see, you're not here to be perfect. You're here to be real. So let go of trying to fit into some mold and just be yourself, flaws and all. Comparison? Yeah, let's ditch that. Seriously, comparing yourself to others only leads to feeling crappy about yourself. Focus on your own journey and be the best version of yourself that you can be. Self-care, baby. You gotta take care of yourself, mind, body, and soul. Whether it's meditating, going for a run, or just chilling in nature, find what fuels your tank and do it regularly. Boundaries, my friend, boundaries. Learn to say no to stuff that drains you or doesn't align with your values. Your time and energy are precious, so guard them fiercely. Last but not least, follow your bliss. Pay attention to what lights you up inside and make time for it. Whether it's painting, dancing, or hanging out with friends, do more of what brings you joy. Life's too short not to. Calibrating your soul to who you truly are is a journey of self-discovery, self-acceptance, and self-expression. It's about living from the inside out, honoring your truth, and embracing the fullness of who you are. As you align with your authentic self, you unleash your innate power and potential, opening the door to a life of abundance, purpose, and joy. So dare to dream big on your personal journey and watch as your soul shines brightly, 
illuminating the path to your highest fulfillment. I really hope you liked this video. And if you found this helpful, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe for more content and share it with anyone who needs a positive lift in their life. Thanks again until next time. Keep dreaming, keep visualizing, and keep manifesting.